This mod review is brought to you by the Farmer Klein YouTube channel. Please like, subscribe, and comment. Hey guys, and welcome back to another mod review. Today we're going to take a look at hand plant saplings. And I know that we are right now planting saplings the farm sim way uh, with the sapling or the tree planter, I should say. And I wanted to start this video out using this thing basically because who really wants to plant trees in a straight line? I mean, seriously. If I want to plant trees, I just want to plant them the way trees grow, just randomly. I don't want to have to plant them in a straight line on flat ground or anything like that. So now that we've basically seen the old way of planting saplings, in farm sim 19 let's go up here back to the shop and we'll talk about the hand plant saplings odd I've got another pallet of saplings here that we're gonna go make use of I'm going to basically run down here to this little area and we're going to put the building down right over here so if we go to the store and we go into miscellaneous, we're going to see we have the Hand Plant Saplings mod, $3,400, $5 a day. What we have to do is we need to place this on the ground wherever we want. All right? So of course if we rotate it, you see it rotates on its center like this. Let's just go ahead and put it down. And what we have in here is we have a shovel, a bag, a little bit of dirt, and a lantern. So at night, the lantern has a nice glow to it, so you can kind of see it. it has a little bit of aura. I saw the lizard, lizard stamp there on the wood. That's pretty cool. Okay, so this is kind of your home base for the hand plant mod. So what we do is we walk up here, and we hit R to take the equipment. Okay, and now we have the bag and we have the shovel so we can use our mouse wheel kind of to rotate so let's say we had the um, chainsaw let's say we had a chainsaw also okay so basically we would be rotating between the chainsaw and the shovel okay we go back up here we can hit R to return it or R to take it out now it says our sapling backpack is currently empty. Let's run back up here. Put it away. So we can't run with it out. Okay. Just like you can't run with the chainsaw. It's probably a good thing. So if we walk up here close to a pallet. And we bring out our shovel. We can left click. And we can remove 10 saplings. Notice we don't have that option. Unless we actually have the shovel out. Okay. Left click. Remove 10 saplings. So now it says backpack. We have 10 pieces. And we have a fir tree. Let's put this away. Let's go back down here. Now let's say we want to basically plant these trees. In a pseudo realistic fashion. We just want to kind of. Meander around and plant them. Let's start up here. Let's put in. Let's get our. There we go. All right. So we see we have a green tree, and it says 0 0.00 meters. So if we left click, we're shoveling, and then basically we have our sapling in the ground. Okay. Now you see that the trees turned red, and we have numbers at the bottom. That numbers is telling us the distance from the tree we just planted to the tree we have in hand. Basically, if we would plant it right here, it'd be 12.57 meters 
from the tree the sapling we just planted right here. So what it does is it allows us to literally just stroll through the woods. Left click. And there we have another sapling in the ground. Let's walk back around here. Left click. And what we can now do is literally just plant these wherever we want without having to worry about trying to navigate the tractor around here, dealing with hills and whatnot. I kind of refer to this as the Johnny Appleseed mod. Because I see this as just basically a guy with a bag of saplings, a shovel, just walking around the woods, randomly planting trees. I see this as being a really cool mod if you're into roleplay and you wanted to basically replant the forest. Maybe you just did a bunch of forestry, you cleared out a big area, now you want to come in and replant it. But you're not really... You're not really cool on uh, just bringing out the tree planter and planting rows of trees. I like to have something with a little bit of variety. Of course, you can put ten trees in before you are full, or empty, I should say. Okay, now let's say we're done. Put it all away. Let's run back to our little storage box. And we hit R to return the equipment. You'll see that we have the bag, and it's got one little sapling in it, because we only had one left in our backpack. We hit R, and add one back to storage. Now we have one in the storage box, our backpack is empty. We can run up here and basically get the rest of our sapling pallet. So, now we have 10 saplings in our backpack. I was really glad to see this mod come out in 17, and I'm really excited to see it here in 19. Now you can see we have basically a bag, so we've got some saplings. Pick these back up. You can add them to storage. There we can have 10 in storage. Then we can repair it, return it. There we could technically have 20 saplings in the box, 10 in storage, and 10 in the bag. And there you go, guys. That is the Hand Plant Saplings mod by GTX. This mod is available for PC only. So guys, let me know in the comments, what do you think of the Hand Plant Saplings mod? Is this something you would use in your gameplay? Something you used in Farm Sim 17? And if you've used it in 19, what do you think? Until next time, happy farming. Be sure to like, subscribe, and click that notification bell.